everybody, welcome back to my channel, or if this is your first time here, hi, my name is Melissa or Missa. Welcome. Today I have what I think is an exciting video. Basically, accessorize did mystery boxes and I bought two because I watched Rosie Pink Rose. I will link her channel up here. She unboxed them like last week and I was super jealous and I told her I was really annoyed that I didn't know it was happening and then she sent me the link when they went back on sale. So I bought two of them. You want to come and say hello? Oh, a handsome potato. <laughs> a handsome potato emerges. <sighs> Your breath is really stinky though. Like I said, I bought two and we're gonna unbox them and I'm very excited because honestly the price was right. This shipping was super fast, I ordered this like what, two days ago? And I haven't had a peek as you can see, so I'm excited to have a peek. Oh, does little baby want to say hello as well? Hello as well. There's a little baby. You're not so little anymore, are you? Oh, this is the £10 mystery box. So the claims for this are over £50 worth of value. It's very light. It almost feels like there's not very much in here. But we'll trust it and we'll see. Okay. Okay, I'm excited. I'm just going to put my hands in. Oh, first up we have woolen gloves. These are quite nice, you know. Wool we'll blend. The price on these is £15, so we're already over the value, to be honest. I mean, a glove's a glove, isn't it? You always need gloves. They're quite nice, nice beige colour. Would wear, will keep. Oh, jewellery. So next up, this is a double circle pendant at a cost of £5. I honestly, the only jewellery I wear is earrings. But it's like a little silver pendant. I mean, the box is already worth 20 quid. It's nice. I wouldn't wear it though. So I'll just give that to someone else that would. <laughs> there you go. Next up, we have Christmas embroidered earrings. These are actually kind of cool. Oh, these are 12 pounds value. I'm trying to show you, but the cats are more in. <laughs> Stop it. They're like uh, fabric with. Who would have cats? Who would have such naughty cats? <laughs> oh, the box is empty now. My camera really does not want to focus on these, does it? But they're like embroidered, embellished. Star earrings. To be honest, they're quite funky and I'd quite like to do maybe like a black and grey and silver look and wear those. So I'm quite chuffed with those and that's £12 value. We have a hair slide that says girls. This cost a fiver according to it. Girls. What's that mean? I probably wouldn't wear this personally and I definitely wouldn't. I don't really wear hair slides but more value. And then the last thing I think in here is this rather fun looking chartreuse bag. It's got like shells on it. It's got, sorry, they're in the box. It's got beading. It's a fabric bag. It's got a tassel, I imagine. Oh, yeah. A big tassel. It says this is £12. I'm not sure what kind of bag this is supposed to be, like what it's for, but I'd probably put makeup in that bag. I wouldn't actually use it as like a bag bag because it's not my style, but you always need makeup bags. Let me just total up the value. It's exactly £50 value and I think for a mystery bag, like it's not like rubbish stuff. Like I think it's quite good stuff. Like Rosie was saying that in her video, um, all the stuff she unboxed, it's like it's not just crap that nobody wants, like it's actually nice stuff that they can sell. Iron Brew is where it's at. Okay, let's move on to the bigger box. This one is a lot heavier, so this is the £20 mystery box and the claim is over £100 of value. So, very excited to see what's in here. I hope I don't get any duplicates. But we'll see. Oh, there is 
a lot. This is like very exciting. Okay, first up on top is a bracelet. This is a five pounds bracelet. It's got like a little gold thing on. It's one of those adjustable ones. Uh, again, to be honest, I don't really wear anything except earrings, but I've got a pair of earrings, which is exciting. Oh, we do have a double up. We have the same silver necklace, which is a fiver. A bit of a shame that it's a double up, but I mean, two of my pals can have the same necklace. This is exciting. A beanie hat. I love beanie hats. This is a really thick one. This is £15. My lord. This will keep them out of for hours. Go chase them. Good boys. Yeah, I adore beanie hats. I wear them every single day in winter, pretty much. And I love black ones. This is really lovely and thick. I mean, it doesn't feel that much better than my pre work one that was like £2, but I'm going to keep that. That is lovely. Then we have... Oh, a little ring. And this is sterling silver ring. This would have cost £14. And it's got like a little bee on it. Really pretty cute. It's a size small and I have absolutely massive sausage fingers. Oh, yeah, it fits. Again, though, I don't really wear jewellery. Um, I find jewellery just irritates me. I don't really like it touching me. So I don't tend to wear it. Then we have a little purse. This has a little pink London bus on it. This is nice. Yeah, that's decent. It's got card slots. It zip up so you can put cash in it. This would cost you £12.50. Do you know what? I actually don't have a purse currently. I've got a little card, uh, card holder. But I don't have a purse. So that's quite nice, yeah probably use that. I mean I probably won't but it is nice. There's something massive in here. Okay next up this is £18. This is a patent envelope clutch. This is like a patent beige clutch bag. It's got like gold hardware on it. £18 like I said. Let's open it up. Yeah and it's got it's got a uh, chain so you can wear it like over your shoulder or across the body. Again, this is not really my style. I actually only ever wear like crossbody bags and they tend to be black or small. This is nice though. I can see a lot of people getting use out of something like this. So, I mean, I'm impressed. Would I wear it? No, but it doesn't mean it's a bad thing. Uh, I think we might be on... Oh! No, nope, there's something else. A little pack of earrings. These would have cost a fiver. But they were all quite nice. Just little stud earrings. Like I said, it's like the only jewellery I wear is earrings. I would wear probably all three pairs, to be honest. So that is really not bad. Once again, would I go out and buy these? No. Maybe. They're nice. I'll keep them. I think this must be our last thing now. Last up is this big tote bag, I would call it, which has, yeah, like London landmarks on it. This is really big. This would set you back, if you were going to buy it, 20 quid. And yeah, it's a really big shopper bag. I, this is absolutely fantastic for me because I use like reusable bags when I do my groceries like I'm sure most of you do and uh, it's nice to have one that's a nice fabric you know and it's kind of pretty to look at and it's got the straps. I like this. Yeah I mean I, I wouldn't go out and buy this exact one just personally but I will use this every single day. In fact I need to go get some groceries today so I'll I'll take this with me. Let's uh, let's total this up. I'm sure it's gonna be right. Twelve pounds fifty. So that I'm really bad at maths. A five or five. I'm not gonna lie. I've already lost count. So you're just gonna have to remember if it if it's value. Fifteen for the hat. 
I'm really impressed. Do you know what? I'm impressed. I just scared the cats there. I am impressed. And there's a lot of things here that'll keep, like the beanie hat, the shopper bag. I'll keep those earrings. I'll keep the gloves. Like I've got a hat, gloves, earrings, and a big shopper. Heaps of other. This is really impressive. Yeah, so that is everything that is in my mystery boxes. Go and see Rosie's video though because she definitely got different things from me and I think you might be interested to see what she also got. Um, if they're still available, if they're back in stock, I'll obviously link them down below if you want to check them out. But for a tenner and 20 quid, I think, I mean, that's pretty good in my books. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this hopefully short and sweet video. Um, are you going to pick one up? Let me know down in the comments. If you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out. Leave me a comment down below. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do three videos a week and our next video is my eyeshadow palette declutter so you don't want to miss that. And yeah, on that note I'm going to piss off, have a lovely day and I'll catch you all on the flip side. They are just hooligans. You're hooligans! What are you doing? Boys!